Tennis icon Martina Navratilova's revelation of a breast and throat cancer diagnosis had her fans sending her warm wishes. The former world number one has been diagnosed with throat cancer and breast cancer. Both of these are in their early stages. Her wife and former Russian model Julia Lemigova vowed to fight the cancer diagnosis together. The Czech-American is considered among one of the greatest players of all time. She has won 59 Grand Slam titles across singles and doubles in her career. The 66-year-old tennis star said, and I quote, This double whammy is serious but still fixable. I'm hoping for a favourable outcome. It's going to stink for a while but I'll fight with all I have got. Navratilova was born in Czechoslovakia and became a US citizen in 1981. She has already battled breast cancer back in 2010. After I had the biopsy that it was going to be nothing. So it was pretty much of a shock that, uh, that uh, it was actually cancerous and now uh, I need to deal with it. And my first thought was, oh no, I can't believe it. But about 10 seconds later, after crying for a little bit, I said, okay, what do we do? The cancer was in stage one and was first discovered in early November during the WTA finals when Navratilova noticed a swelling in her neck that did not go down. At the same time as Martina was undergoing the test for the throat, a suspicious form was found in her breast, which was subsequently diagnosed as cancer, completely unrelated to the throat cancer. The tennis great said her prognosis is good and she will start treatment this month. Navratilova now works as a tennis presenter on television and radio. She said she would not travel to Melbourne to be part of Tennis Channel's coverage of the Australian Open from January 16th to 29th, but she hopes to contribute to the broadcasts via video conference. For more informative videos like this, keep watching India Today Newsmo.